Gossip Girl's Chase Crawford plays the pretty boy co-star in The Haunting of Molly Hartley and is probably reason number one your teens want to see it. Chances are, when all is said and done, he'll be the only thing they remember. Molly Hartley is a forgettable fright flick if ever there was one. It's not over the top scary, it's not even reasonably suspenseful, it's just pretty bad. Molly's had it tough, her mom tried to kill her in order to save her, and now she's trying to rebuild her life in another town. What she doesn't know is that her parents made a deal with the devil. Molly would be his when she turned 18. Get my hand away from me! Molly, the nurse let me out. She let me out because she believes. What do you want from me? To save you. That's all I want. You have no idea what you're about to become. Can you feel it, Molly? There's evil everywhere. The darkness is coming for you, honey. It's coming. There's violence, but most of it is bloodless. Teens kiss and one strips down to her bra while changing. The swearing is frequent and a bit on the strong side. Underage characters drink what appears to be alcohol at a party. The movie is loaded with religious references and conversations about how best to beat back the devil. Is there a message? Not really. But your teenage girls will still think Chase Crawford is all that. Common Sense recommends The Haunting of Molly Hartley only for teens who are at least 14 years old. For more movie, television, and video game reviews, visit us at commonsense.com. I'm Kimio Nanaka.